Hey, good morning. I'm certified meteorologist Brandon Orr watching the progress of Tropical Storm Debbie that is now passing not only to the west of Key West, but now to the west of about Naples or so expected to really strengthen a little bit later on today. In fact, by this afternoon, we expect this to near hurricane status and it's going to be over hurricane status by the time it reaches the Big Bend area of northern Florida and makes landfall just to the north of Cedar Key in the Big Bend area. That's where we're expecting a lot of storm surge and then very heavy rainfall is going to be the main threat up towards the Carolinas where this slows down. I'm talking about more than 20 inches of rain up there. So we're going to be talking about Debbie for quite some time throughout much of this week. We are still getting some effects from the outer rain bands of this today and some of these rain bands uh, will move through and they're not going to be very frequent. They're only be a couple of them so much of today will be dry but when that rain comes down it's going to come down pretty heavy could see some minor flooding in some areas could see some strong damaging wind gusts in some of these lots of lightning and even the low chance of maybe a tornado or two here's one of those final rain bands pushing through the keys later on this morning into the afternoon and then most of our models have the timing of late this afternoon into the evening for our final push of rain bands from this system but really it could be any time this afternoon that we see some of this move through with some of that heavy rain going into the rest of the week. It'll linger some moisture behind, so I'll keep rain chances high 40 50%. That's going to be that daily chance of afternoon showers and thunderstorms fueled off all the heating that we're going to see. Lots of heat in the forecast 94 95 heat index to 110 if not higher. A very hot week ahead behind this storm system. Updates on local10.com.